Hey guys, welcome back to Sean Does DIY. Today we're going to take a look at the rigid HD 1400 14 gallon wet dry vac. So let's get started. So I went ahead and picked up this new shop vac because I used one underneath the bench for my dust collection, but I decided I wanted a bigger one to be able to kind of cart around without having to pull that guy out. So yeah, so this one might actually replace the one that's under the bench and I'll pull that one out uh, because this one's a little bit more powerful. Um, so yeah, anyways, this should be a pretty uh, short video because it's a shop vac, there's not a lot to it. Uh, yeah, so we'll pull it out of the box here, see what we got. I mean, there's not a lot of assembly for these things. See, we got some uh, hose wands, looks like a caddy of some sort. Here's some uh, hose adapters. Move that stuff out of the way. Let's see. And there it is. That's all that's in the box. Let's see, I'm assuming the rest of the pieces are gonna be in side here. All right, let's see. Yep, I got the hose. Got some instructions. We got all the wheels, kind of something from rigid. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and turn this over because this one I'm gonna go ahead and put the wheels on probably. Let's see what we got. Kind of stuff. So we're gonna need a uh, screws out of here. There we go. Gonna need a Phillips head. And I guess I could look at the instructions, but it's pretty easy. Um, I mean, it all goes the same way. So this goes right here, all the way around. All the wheel pieces. Let's see, looks like it's all the way down. There we go. All right, so I'm just gonna screw all these pieces on and then we'll go from there. So once you get all the feet uh, things installed, just pop these uh, wheels in there, the casters. And, oof, yeah, tight. There you go. And then, you know, you can put on the, uh, all this little caddy things and whatnot. There we go. So it looks like this, uh, this piece, where does this one go? <laughs> oh, it goes right here. So this one goes over here. It looks like there's a, So this one you can, it's removable. So it just snaps on, use these screws. Um, and this is a uh, quick lock deal to get your filter off. So don't forget if you're doing wet, you know, you're sucking up water or something, uh, take the filter off because this thing gets wet, it'll be screwed up. So yeah. Uh, but I'm going to leave it on there for now because there's a float in here. So, you know, when you're using a wet dry vac, when you grow wet, just like a toilet, this float will come up when it gets wet and it'll stop the suction and go, and you'll know it's full. So, well, put the filter back on. Pretty nice. It just kind of snaps on there. You don't have to worry about losing like a little screw thing or bolt deal or whatever. There we go. Let's push it on. Maybe, there we go. Sweet. And of 
course it just snaps in place and you're done. It's got a pretty long cord. Not really sure how long it is, probably 15, 20 feet. I'll, uh, I'll actually measure it later on and I'll put that in the description below if you're interested. Nice long screw, or uh, screw. We got a handle, it just goes up here. Screws that down. And it looks like it's idiot proof. So idiots like me put it on the right way. that one, didn't I? It's hard to see up here. There we go. Oh, man. There we go. Yep. Tighten, tighten, tighten. Looks like some uh, little caddy guys go on here, like so. I guess those are for the wands, probably. So we'll just put one on real quick. Now they do make different filters if you're doing wet work that you can put on there. If you got a lot of like, you're sucking up some kind of mud or something that's got a lot of particulates in it. Um, but that's sold separately. You can go on Ridge's website and check it out, I guess, or an orange store. Ooh. Okay. So those caddy, those go on there and it looks like that holds the, the wands or the hose probably, I guess more likely. You wrap your hose up in there because the wands and stuff go down here. Yeah, that makes more sense. <laughs> so that'll that'll hold your hose up there. Put all the little pieces on all of these. You got an extra one. So stick it on the deal there. So yeah, HD 400, uh, or HD 1400 rigid shop vac, 14 gallons. Uh, six horsepower, and yeah, it's a shop back. There ain't much to it. So yeah, it's uh, 14 gallons. Yep, that's it. All right, guys, well, it's a shop back. There you go. Uh, let's plug it in, see if she works. The hose all entangled over here. Let's see. Cool. Shot back. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.